everyone and welcome back to Crypto Lad Leak. In today's video, we're just going to do a follow-up on the Latium X platform. We'll touch on the exchange part in a bit because there are two exchanges that currently have LATX up for vote to get listed on their exchange. So many of you may have seen our ICO review on Latium. Uh, the website was latium.org and they had an ICO in the beginning of January. Uh, the company raised about $15 million in Ethereum and Bitcoin, uh, as well as fiat payment as well. And the important thing to know about Latium is they are an ERC-20 token called the LATX. Now they also have an LAT token floating around from a presale, which can be converted into LATX tokens, which is going to be the main token, the LATX token is the main token for their Latium platform. So what makes Latium unique is their platform. It's not necessarily their token. So what they've developed is a sort of a social media tasking platform where an ecosystem of a labor force and people looking to hire a labor force can coexist and work with each other to post jobs and pay these jobs quickly uh, in cryptocurrency, in the LATX token. So they're sort of uh, crowdsourcing the internet, bring the internet to your cause. So in this video, we'll do a little bit of review on the Latium Alpha platform. So if you just go to latium.org, if you scroll down about halfway through, you'll see the connect to the Latium Alpha platform. Just click on that. And then once you're on the Latium Alpha platform, you can just sign in, register for an account. Um, if you participated in the crowd sale but haven't yet made an Alpha account, you can just recreate a new account. It can be the same or a new email address and a new password. Now, once you get into the Alpha platform, you'll be able to see the top header and you can just click on now hiring to see a news feed in descending order in terms of time listed of all the jobs available currently on the platform. So you'll see actually Crypto Live Leak has a lot of jobs being offered right now on this platform. It's small jobs such as, you know, subscribe to our YouTube channel or share this video, make this video go viral, share it on a few different social platforms. So if you guys do go ahead and sign up for an alpha account, feel free to apply to some of these jobs that I'm posting here on Latium, and then you'll get rewarded in the LATX token once you follow all the steps and complete the job. So the team is going to consistently be making updates to this platform, and they do plan on releasing a beta version later in Q1 2018. And once they do release this beta version, that's when they're going to make a hard marketing push and push to get this coin listed on more exchanges. We'll touch on the exchange part in a bit because there are two exchanges that currently have LATX up for vote to get listed on their exchange. So you can also see the top header if you click on profile, that's where it gives you a summary of all the jobs that you have listed and that you're participating in yourself. So if you don't have any jobs listed yourself on Latium, this is where you can see jobs you're working on. And then of course you have the hire button up top. If you wanted to post a job, you would actually need LATX tokens on the Latium platform before you can post a job because you're going to need them um, secured on the platform in order to pay out the people that you're hiring. So you can't just create jobs unless you have the amount of LATX that you're going to be giving out as a reward for the job completion on your account on this platform. And then you'll see the notifications and menu section uh, in the top headers as well. So again, if the, if the functions aren't working for you, this is just an alpha version of the platform. Um, they just have it up so they can gain user feedback and then make more adjustments to the platform, make it more user friendly and help it really evolve into what it should be in order to gain uh, a lot of users and scalability. So they do, the company Latium actually did go ahead and post some Medium articles about how to uh, get started with the Alpha platform. I'll be sure to link those articles down in the description box below. And then now let's touch on the exchanges. I see in their Telegram group, there's a lot of users that are just constantly asking when is LATX going to be on an exchange because it is not currently on an exchange. Again, the ICO just ended about mid-January 2018, so it hasn't been that long. Uh, and now there are two exchanges that currently have LATX up for a vote to get listed on their exchange. So first exchange we have is BitZ, and this is the one I believe has the best chance of being listed. So basically what you have to do is you have to sign up for a BitZ account using the Latium team's referral. And once you do create your account and get a level three verification, you have to enter your name, your email address, your address of where you live, uh, as well as some documents and images of your photo ID and of a picture of you holding up, you know, a little sign that says BitZ in the current date. So just follow the steps to get level three verification on BitZ. Use and make sure when you when you sign up for the first time um, that you're using the the Latium referral code. Uh, they outline it on a Medium article they posted. I'll have that again in the link below. And then once you do sign up, again, level three verification, and you'll actually be given uh, 50 free VTC coins, which is the coin used to vote on BitZ's exchange. 
So you see if you click on the vote section in the top header in BitZ, you'll see Latium. You'll see a section where you can vote once you're logged in. And it will be these coins, these VTC coins, that will be applicable towards this vote. And it's also very important to note that if the LATX token does get voted on to BitZ for exchange listing, all the people that voted will receive back their VTC tokens that they used to vote. And also there will be a 500,000 LATX reward given out to all the people that participated in the vote based on their weight of VTC that was contributed to the vote. So each person can contribute up to 200 VTC on this LATX vote per account. And again, you'll get the 50 free VTC by signing up to BitZ with the Latium referral code. So if you wanted to fill in that additional 150 VTC for the vote, I believe you'd have to purchase that in addition. But again, you'll get that back if Latium, when Latium gets 100% of the vote required to be listed on the exchange. And this vote is going on for about seven days until about February 20th. And we actually need 1 million VTC coins applied to this Latium vote in order for the coin to be listed on this exchange. Now, BitZ is a sort of an obscure exchange that not many of us have heard of before. However, it is the 12th largest exchange in the cryptocurrency space. So it has some good volume. It has more volume than KuCoin, surprisingly. And I do like the system they use to get the coins, any coin really, onto their platform. So everyone in the community, in the Latium community, Please step up, sign up for BitZ with the Latium referral code, and let's get voting for LATX to get listed on BitZ. We can do it. And we have another exchange, which could be more familiar to you. It's definitely a more popular exchange. It's Hubi.pro. Hubi.pro recently incorporated a voting system where you can vote with their coin to get other altcoins added to their exchange. And if you'll see on the list here, uh, LATX is, is very far down the list here in terms of um, coins that have been voted for. I believe there's still 14 days left to vote on these list of coins on Hubi. Uh, however, it doesn't look like we have a great chance unless the community somehow turns and adds a lot more voting power to this section here on Hubi.pro. So this is just the beginning. Um, this is the team. This is the team's first efforts to get these coins listed on an exchange. It doesn't look like they're outright paying for the coins to be listed. It looks like they're going through the process of having the community vote for the coin to be listed. Uh, this, this is a unique tactic and it can show the strength of a community, it can build a community when you have events like this happen. And you know, I do think it is, it's a good stepping stone, it's a good starting place for Latium to uh, get this coin LATX listed on exchanges. But I just want you guys to remember that the true value in the Latium project is the actual alpha platform and eventually when the beta platform gets released, it is their tasking platform that carries all the value. The LATX token is just a simple ERC-20 token that was developed to use exclusively on their platform. In my mind, the value of LATX will go up if the user base goes up on their platform. So feel free, take a look, check out that alpha platform, sign up for an account, apply to some jobs that Crypto Live Leak is offering, and get some free LATX for completing those jobs. I'm really excited about this project here, as it can help um, a lot of online businesses sort of direct the internet to their cause. Like myself, Crypto Live Leak, um, I'll be posting a lot of jobs on Latium's platform, so keep an eye out for that in the future and the ones that we already have there. All right, guys, I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. And, and also, um, the Latium team has a great admin response on their Telegram channel, so be sure to find them on Telegram as well. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Until next time, take care.